In October, we reported on a tractor trailer accident on Highway 44 in Franklin County, transporting 29 horses. Longmeadow Rescue Ranch giving 15 of the horses a path to recovery. Fox 2's Bridget Mahoney visited the ranch today to find out what's next for them. Long Meadow Rescue Ranch wasn't originally a stopping point for the horses on the road trip up 44, but the accident giving them a new and improved destination. It's also um, a twist of fate for them. A detour in the road on I-44. Where these horses would not have survived if they hadn't have been part of that trailer wreck. Later when we found out that it was a trailer where those horses were headed for slaughter. The semi heading for slaughter running off the passing lane overturning on its side on October 18th in Franklin County. So we had darkness the entire time we were out there. It was raining and it was a cold night. There's a lot of adrenaline that's pumping because you can hear the horses that are still in the trailer struggling and you want to get to help them, um, but you have to slowly move through the trailer um, to get the horses out one by one. Of the 15 surviving horses, 12 were transported to Longmeadow Rescue Ranch, where the worst of the accident took a turn for the better. There was about eight weeks of at least two employees that spent the entire day treating wounds. We were wrapping legs. Um, I mean, we had horses that had three out of four of their legs wrapped, and that means they had numerous lacerations. The first two months, the toughest for the team from managing trauma, stress, and weight. But now, three months later... Oh, they race around, and they're playing, and they're nutty, and we're kind of like, oh, don't hurt yourself. <laughs> Without pain and ready for their forever home. Six out of the 12 currently available for adoption, giving even the worst of luck a twist for the better. For the 12 horses that are here, it definitely was a good thing. And they've endured some horrible pain, but they've made it through. The entire team is happy to see all of the horses free of pain, but Amanda told me the best moment is going to be when the first horse gets adopted. If you want to learn more about that, you can visit their website, which we have linked up on our website. Also, if you can't adopt, you can always support their Amazon wish list. Reporting in Union Meteorologist Bridget Mahoney.